What's up, everybody? How's it going today? Hope everybody's doing well. I uh, I just wanted to take a minute and talk about something that happened to me uh, last night. Uh, I had, I guess if you will, my own little personal Christmas story experience. And the Lord showed me something last night that was just absolutely amazing. I was on my way home last night to carry back the two inmates that had been helping me for the last few weeks, uh, Marcus and Charlie. And we were having a conversation about different topics, different things. And I started talking to them about just different things that happen in your life, you know. And one of the things that I started talking about, or two of the couple of things, was uh, our attitudes and our perceptions. And guess what happened? I got under conviction. You say, about what? Well, it's about my own attitude. The last few weeks, I've had a very poor attitude in front of them. And the Lord dealt pretty harshly with me about it. And for, for whatever reason, and I don't know, uh, I've just been frustrated. And I've been frustrated in front of them. And they saw it in me. And they saw it on me. And the worst part about it is they saw it out. Out of me. From me. And it was all on me. And let's just be honest. Most of the time it is. It's all on us. So I pulled over and I did my very best to own my mistake. And I didn't ask them to own anything, to own any mistakes that they made. Uh, the reality of the moment was it wasn't about them. It was all about me. And once we got going again, both of these guys, they started to encourage me. And they, was, they started trying to tell me how much of a blessing that I was to them. And they had no idea, and still don't, that I was the one who was being blessed. I'm still being blessed from what happened uh, last night. They didn't even hesitate, guys. They came right in, and I mean, they rushed in to prop me up in that moment, to prop me up on my leaning side. And that, my friends, is how God showed me an old thing in a new way. He allowed things to happen to me for the last few weeks to get me off kilter, to get me out of character, and then boom, God cut me down so that he could, just so that he could use two of the most unlikely people on the planet to help raise me back up. <laughs> How about that for a modern day Christmas story? I say all that to say this to you today. Never, ever underestimate the power of a lesson learned. It ain't always what it looks like. But it's up to me and to you to figure out what God is trying to tell us and show us. It's up to me to figure out what God's showing me. And I'm not always the best or the fastest learner. But I found out that God is always the best teacher. What's he trying to show you today? What's he trying to teach you today? And if you look around... Who is he trying to use to teach you? Think about that. So until next time, from me and all of us at Mud Creek Baptist Church, I want to wish you the happiest and merriest Christmas of all. God bless you. We love you.